Hi guys, it's Cal from Nerdy Weasel. Welcome back to Fallout 4 Modding. I've been playing Fallout 4 for a while now for my blind let's play. And one of the things that has always bugged me is the mini games for hacking and lockpicking. Many of you are like me and just want to bypass these aspects of the game. Today I'm going to show you a set of mods to reduce or completely eliminate those frustrating mechanics. They are the appropriately named Easier Hacking and Easier Lockpicking by Rawberry400. We'll be using Nexus Mod Manager to install these mods, so let's get started. First, we'll be reviewing in-game what we're talking about. So we're going to take a look at both the lockpicking and hacking mechanisms, and we all know the mechanics in this. You know, you get unlock, and you can try to unlock it, and you see how many bobby pins you have. And, you know, you can break bobby pins this way. Okay, gotta break it, gotta break it. There we go, broke it. So there's that and uh, you can go ahead and escape out. So we all know how that works. And uh, let's go over and check the unlock with the hacking on the computer terminal. Come on, let me in, let me in, there we go. And you see it's gonna go through all the lists and you're gonna have a bunch of words on here. We all know how this works. And uh, you have to go through and find the right word, so. You know, there's a bunch from here depending on the difficulty of the computer. So let's go ahead and exit out of that. Now let's go show you how to install a mod to uh, change both those mechanics. So here we are at our desktop and you can see I have Nexus Mod Manager open for Fallout 4 and we're appropriately logged in. And it seems appropriate that, you know, since this is the first episode of Fallout 4 modding that I have no mods installed. And we're going to fix that right now. The mods that we've chosen for this are called Easier Hacking with Options, Easy Lockpick, and Guaranteed Lockpick by Rawberry400. It's Nexus Mods number 306. And you can see that basically he's going to, you know, add a number of functions into the game that include Easier Hacking with Options, and that will change the number of words that are shown on the computer screen so you can actually adjust the difficulty that you want to have in your game. Easy Lockpick and Guaranteed Pickpocket. We won't be installing Guaranteed Pickpocket, but you'll see in the faux mod that's included with the mod that you can actually install it. And there's there's my old video on how to install it manually. But Easy Lock Pick doesn't have a difficulty option. It's just 100% chance. Okay, I would go ahead and read these options. Obviously, you know, it's a good idea to, you know, read everything before you install any mods. And when you come over to the file section, right there, it's going to open up and you can see that the main file is easier hacking with options, easy lockpick, and guaranteed pickpocket. You can see that is Nexus Mod Manager compatible. That's good because we're using Nexus Mod Manager. And you can see download with manager. Go ahead and click that. And we will now open up Nexus Mod Manager again. And you can see it's down here in our download manager. And it is downloaded. Or it's downloading. There it goes. A little slow today on the Nexus. And there we go. So when you come up here, highlight it and activate it. Now, Rawberry 400 is, is, has included a foam mod. And what this is going to do is show you the options that you'll be installing. Each of these different options are the difficulty there in, that's involved in each one of them. So the hacking options, if you just want, you know, dead simple, you have one word, only one word will appear on the screen for you to choose. If you want a little bit of a challenge, there's three words, five words, eight words, all the way up to 10 words. By choosing one of these, you can only choose one, you'll be installing a separate ESP, only one. If you have more than one ESP installed, they're gonna conflict, so just choose one. I'm a YouTuber, I only want one option to make things fast, one option. When you come down to lock, pick, and pickpocket, each of these are different ESPs. Easy lockpick, any position on the bobby pin gives 100% chance. I want that as well. If you want to have a guaranteed 100% pickpocket, you can choose that option and it'll install a separate ESP for that. I don't need that, so we're going to go ahead and leave that unchecked. And you simply click to install. And it's done. So when you go over to your plugins, you can see now we have Fallout 4 ESM, Easy Lockpick ESP, and easy hacking one word. Two ESPs installed, even though there were multiple ESPs in the mod itself they could use from. So thanks to Rawberry for installing a foam mod on that because it really makes it easy. And that's simply all there is to it. We can now launch the game and remember my selection and yes. 
and we'll go play and see what it does. So here we are back at the same door in computer terminal. If we come down to the lockpick and we click E to enter, we're going to go ahead and notice that uh, no matter what we do, we open it. Got it. Just done. I mean, just that simple. 100% chance. Okay, now the computer terminal. If we try to unlock this and let it go through its login, we'll just speed it up here. You can see all the other words are gone and you only have fried left. So that's one word. Makes it very easy. Nice. And we're in. So if you you know don't appreciate the mechanics of the mini games for this, that's one option. You know, some people do, some people don't. I'm not a big fan of the uh, the mini games. It just takes up my time. But uh, it, like I said, it doesn't change the difficulty level of the locks in the computer hacking. It just changes the words and the easiness thereof. So there you go, guys. I hope those two mods will uh, improve your game. And if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and join me on my Let's Play that will be every Wednesday and Saturday from here on out. So once again, guys, thanks again. My name's Cal. I'm from Dirty Weasel, and I'm signing off.